Okay, guys, this is Cowards from Cowards Corner. Welcome back, Men's Mental Health Month. Um, so we're going over today, remember, personal hygiene, personal hygiene. We want to help you with self-love, real self-love, which is self-awareness, personal hygiene, getting your body right, getting your mind right. This is how it works. This is where you can start from, men. So today, we're going to go over brushing your teeth because, I, you know, it's a lot of y'all walking around with breath smelling like Dungeon Dragons, raw onions and old sub sandwiches mixed with collard greens from the next day and it's okay it's okay i was i was actually in the uh same environment with um booty mouth when when you all you know trying to come up out this depressive nature and and all that good stuff so we don't want the butt mouth um now we're going to start off like i did with shaving what are our components, right? So let's look at our components here. Let me swap this over. Okay, so we have our Listerine. It's a little bottle there. We have Crest toothpaste, that's what I use. A regular toothbrush. We have, uh, I have a Philips Sonicare and Oral-B. One has a bigger head on it. One has a smaller head on it. Reason why to get in different places. Uh, and hydrogen peroxide. So, this is what it, what I do is um, let me see uh, a listerine here. This is the the one one pint one pint. It's a little one, and where it is to this line, I fill that up with hydrogen peroxide, right? And I just shake it up. I've had this little bottle forever. What I do because we got to save money right fellas this stuff is not cheap so so we want to you go out you can go get a sam's card costco card or you find a sale walmart get the big one and then you you can have a little one and just pour it in that way you can mix but you save on the um, price per ounce right so now i want to show you what makes teeth clean and easy because nobody shows you a process to brush your teeth. They're just like, hey, brush your teeth. Breath smell like garbage, right? So I'm not gonna do it like that. Now, what I'm gonna do, I got, I have my floss. Oh, I forgot. Let me go back to the little thing here. Okay, so, and I forgot a tongue scraper, right? Most of you guys haven't seen one of these or haven't used one. Tongue scraper, you can ah, scrape your tongue, get all that ew, ew, off of there because I wanna let you guys know something. A lot of you guys out here love to kiss. You love to kiss and you're not taking care of your mouth. Okay? Now, I have another thing over here to a, a water pick. Now, this might not be in your affordable range, but you can get them off of Amazon. It's a couple cheap ones. Uh, range about 30 bucks to 70 bucks, something like that. But that cleans out all that stuff in your mouth and also does a little pressure washing on your teeth to get you a little brighter, whiter shine. Right? Okay, so the first thing we want to do, we want to rinse. We want to just rinse our mouth, like get that garbage out. Like, now I'm going to make this fast. Don't judge me. But normally it's longer than that, right? Just doing this for demonstration. Right? We want to start rinsing our mouth for about 30 minutes, 30 seconds, right? We want our mouth to uh, be, you know, start getting ready to be prepped, to be washed. You don't just take the car out and hit the soap. You want to spray out all the garbage, right? So let's look at what we have right here. Regular toothbrush. Just regular toothbrush, which most of us own. Okay. We have our, you know, um, I guess you call this electronic electric toothbrush. Um, something like electric toothbrush. Floss. So what we want to do first, we want to go ahead, so we rinse our mouth, rinse out with water after. We want to get some floss. I'm just going to do a couple of teeth to show you what we're going for because we're going to do the front ones and 
go back you rinse again your mouth is going to feel weird because you're you're getting rid of all this stuff now you also with getting rid of your mouth all those germs they go to the rest of the body so the cleaner your mouth is the healthier you are right you can you can almost tell people with the the teeth aren't really well the gums are bad they're usually sick right because mold and and all that the icky things they grow in warm cool places warm dark places rather so they can grow in your nose your mouth they grow where these things happen so you can get bad teeth uh, you know i've had friends people have bad teeth affected their heart put them in the hospital for days sometimes so I, this is a big focus guys and plus ladies like likes teeth right so let's look at this now i'm just going to use a regular toothbrush for now because a lot of people can't afford these things so um, some of these Sonicares and things like that they can be pretty expensive now or expensive to you when you don't have money so what you can do you can look for them on sale you can save your money and um, but just shop around you have Google just you type in um, electric toothbrushes Sonicare lowest price or plus lowest price and, and start finding these things. But until then, we have this puppy right here. Okay, so let me reshape this thing. All right, now to make this easier for you, we wanna brush our teeth in quadrants. So we separate those middle teeth and this is quadrant one, this is quadrant two, this is quadrant three, this is quadrant four, from the big tooth all the way back, right? We put on, we apply our toothpaste. I don't, I'm gonna show you how to apply it, but I'm not really um, gonna go through it. So you don't really need that much. Let's see. So I'll put it on about that much, right? Cause I may, I may spit out and may have to reapply because my mouth is a little dirtier than I thought. So some people try to use it and say, oh, I did it, but it's kind of gross. Like cleaning dishes in dirty water. So I'm gonna let me take this off because I want to show you guys this. Just wasted that toothbrush. That's like that was probably like a um, 32 cent worth of toothbrush on there. When you and y'all know I feel broke, man. Y'all when you when you lose on your money, you coming back. You coming back. You're not broke. You coming back. All right. So you're gonna go in. See, I'm moving my mouth. To get to that tooth like I can see it I can get to it when I can't see it I probably can't get to it see like you don't I can't see my front teeth can't get to it right shape your mouth get to it get in there and then you're gonna go slow and you're gonna open your mouth just a little bit so you can get all the way back and you're coming around you're gonna circle circle and you're hitting the gum you see how I'm hitting the gums and you go back and forth. Man, almost like you're doing a rep of 10. Because that makes it easier for me, right? We need a goal. So a rep of 10. One, two, three. And then you get in the high and hit. And you should feel it. It's going to tickle underneath on that other side a little bit. Sometimes some people don't. Don't judge me. It makes you make faces. Now right, you get up there. scrub it because your teeth actually they, they reflect from the back so 
the cleaner they are in the back, the cleaner they can be seen in the front. So you want to get both sides. And you're doing these quadrants, right? You go down, you get quadrant. This, I'm actually doing three and four here, right? You get these quadrants, and you do your 10 reps. And you try to get these bristles in between so your teeth when you floss. You want that, but still keep trying to circle. And you're gonna fill in the roof of your mouth because the roof of your mouth also smells like garbage if you have it. So you get that other quads are the same way. And circle, getting in there, getting in there all the way back. And sometimes you might have to open your mouth a little bit, just pull your mouth and pull it, pull it. I mean, you're the one walking around with donkey mouth. Underneath your tongue. Now underneath your tongue, when you finally clean over there, it's like a film under this big rope. Okay, and listen, people, people are kissing you and you are kissing somebody else, so it also makes your selection better because you won't put your tongue in everybody's nasty mouth. Alright? So, you get your quadrants, you get all clean, and you are good to go. So after that, what are we gonna do? We're gonna rinse again. Come back up. But we're gonna do that for another 10 to 20 seconds. Mouth is gonna start feeling fresh. Now, here comes when you actually start making your money, fellas, if you can afford it now. Miss a couple of dates, don't take anybody out, but I'm telling you, your dates will increase when you get one of these. It's a water flosser, right? Water pick, water flosser, whatever they call it these days. You get this, Joker. And it's kind of loud, but you want to get this and you go back through the quadrants and you get all in between every groove of your teeth and you get front and back and you do it in quadrants. The things you will see that come out from your mouth is horribly gross. Know that that is going into your mouth from somebody else and out to your mouth to somebody else. It is horribly nasty and um, It'll make your selection process and who you choose to be in your life, it, it, it'll sharpen it up. And, and you guys will probably sharpen each other up. So there we go. We have the teeth. We've done this. Oh, the last thing I forgot. I don't want to forget this. So we brushed our teeth. We're filling all rinse. We've rinsed off. So we're going to rinse again, that, that next rinse. And you just put a little bit of toothpaste on your toothbrush and we're going to brush that tongue. Ah, uh -huh. I mean brush that tongue, get it, get it all irritated, get underneath. And you have these, these don't, these um, tongue scrapers. They don't cost that much. I mean, um, like a buck or two, they're pretty cheap. You get your tongue scraper. And you scrape that tongue. I didn't really, ugh, I had a little bit. I had a little bit, mm, that came off. But you want to scrape that tongue, right? Get that stuff out of your mouth. Re-scrub, rinse, scrape that tongue. And then you brush that tongue again. Because your tongue is going to keep, the tongue is what keeps that mouth really kind of funky a little bit. It's just holding stuff. And it's growing stuff. And then you get on the top of your mouth. As far back as you can all the way back to those other teeth. So you're getting all of that and your mouth now feels super duper clean. So guys or uh, ladies with, with sons that you know the dad's not there, I wasn't there in my children's life a lot of times so I wanna let you know like hey, let's be here now, this is how you brush your teeth fellas. So work on that. Get your mind right, get your body right. Remember, it's all about self-awareness. So now that we know our breath smells like garbage or, or boot shoots, now we can, we can handle that. And we have one less thing down. So much life, guys. Hey, guys. Thank you for choosing Cowrie's Corner and listening to her voice. 
in the upcoming weeks you'll also hear his voice but if you want to be a part of it please go sign up at www.cowriescorner.com become a member of the website and let me know your question and i'll give you a call and you can be um, a participant on his or her voice talk to you soon and do not forget the um men's conference is on june 17th through the 28th and i hope to see all of you guys there much life much love